Okay, hey gamers, this is uh, Stefan Wolf, and I'm um, coming at you with a new game this week. So uh, let's hear all my pups out there. How? Howl's right, gamers. Uh, this week we've got uh, Dream TV. Uh, this is a funny little one. This is kind of it's got a similar story to what uh, Indoomin, me and Doomin got going on over here. Um, it's about we just got two two normal kids. Uh, and they get this strange, this weird game in the mail. And then after looking at the game for a while, they decide that they want to play it. And when they play it, they get transported into the game. Um, so the guy who did that, his name is uh, The Critic. And he's really mean. And now I have to fight for my life. Uh, to get my way out of this shitty world. Um, I got like nine hidden puzzle pieces from every level. And, um, then, then I gotta fight the critic or something? I'm not really sure. But let's just hop right to this, gamers. Whoa, buddy! Who are you calling rats? You look like more rat than I do. Not the medieval world. Yeah, okay, bud. Already did that. Let's try this again. We gotta collect uh, all you know those puzzle pieces I was telling you about. Uh, kids. Yeah. We gotta pick those up, and then they're finally on the side of the dungeon. Good luck to you too, bud. Um, sorry, yours. All right. So, uh, first tip is you don't beat up every human you see because they all want to hurt you. Uh, second tip: those red things are health potions. Blue ones are mana potions. I don't know what the mana potions are for, guys. One second. I don't want to leave my buddy back there yet. I don't need his help. Alright. It's time to do this. So normally, you guys would want two controllers. Um... This is like a good multiplayer game, but no one's here today, so I'm just going to show you guys what this game's about. If I have to review this game, I'm going to say, I'm going to say the graphics are... It's about a five. They're all pretty much the same. Mm. The sound is not scary at all. It's full of dungeons, and there should be ghost sounds, and slime sounds, and chemical sounds. I don't know, this just isn't very spooky for me. keep them together, they're stronger. Just keep that in mind. You play both characters if you just hold one direction for a little bit. 
I'm like the bush and I was telling you about cameras. So this is where things get a little trickier. We got skeletons, we got those things, we got keys. There's a lot of weird stuff going on right now and I can't really give you all the answers you want. Only you can decide those. So I'm just gonna jump down here. This is the skeleton deck. So don't go down there, gamers. This is dangerous. Sometimes you just gotta fight the skeleton. And then you beat the skeleton. And then the skeleton can't talk shit about you anymore. Alright, so we only have six pieces left. Um so I should go pretty high. <laughs> oh. oh fuck. Oh my god. Sorry gamers, this is way harder than I thought it was gonna be. This is insane gamers. I'm sorry. Alright, that's just not possible. That's too hard. It's just too hard, gamers. I would recommend not to play this game. This game is way too hard. Alright, gamers, you're gonna see some MLG action and play here. You're gonna see what got me uh, recruited. Um, it's one of my patented moves. Creep! And you just, you leave the rest of your team behind, and, um, you just, you just take it. Alright, gamers, I'm gonna, I'm gonna unlock this gate here, we're gonna go on through to the other side. Um, this is a special trick, not many people know about it. So, you have to do exactly how I have. You need one guy at each of these doors. You have to put in the Konami code as both of the guys. And then we'll see what happens, alright? 